Hello, I'm Jason, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Dallas, Texas. Today, I'm going to show you how to troubleshoot AWS resource permission errors in Amazon QuickSight. Let's get started. When editing the QuickSight permissions to AWS services, you may find changes can't be saved. To solve this, I will show you how to remove the managed policies that QuickSight attaches to the service roles and restore QuickSight access to your AWS services. After logging into the AWS Management Console using an admin account, navigate to the IAM console. In the navigation pane, choose Roles. Search for the service role, AWS QuickSight Service Role V0, or AWS QuickSight S3 Consumers Role V0. Select the service role. Choose Delete and confirm the deletion. Now in the navigation pane, choose Policies. Here, search for the customer managed policies that start with AWS QuickSight. In the Filter by Type drop down list, filter by Customer Managed. Select AWS QuickSight IAM policy. Choose Delete. And then confirm the deletion by entering the policy name in the text input field. Now let's do the same steps for the remaining customer managed policies. To restore the QuickSight access to your AWS services with a user that has QuickSight admin privileges, navigate to QuickSight Console. In the navigation bar, choose your username to see the drop down list and then choose Manage QuickSight. In the navigation pane, choose Security and Permissions and then choose Manage under QuickSight Access to AWS Services. Keep the user QuickSight Managed Role default option selected. Check the services that you want to allow QuickSight to access. And then choose Save. With this, the QuickSight service role is recreated along with the needed policies. To avoid hitting the same issue again, use only the QuickSight console to edit QuickSight permission to AWS resources. And now you know how to troubleshoot AWS resource permission errors in Amazon QuickSight. Thanks for watching, and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.